University of Arkansas at Pine Bluff has been exploring methods to establish and expand sustainable strawberry production in Arkansas. The project is funded by a grant from the Walmart Foundation and administered by the University of Arkansas System, Division of Agriculture, Center for Agricultural and Rural Sustainability. At UAPB, the overall goal of the Strawberry Project was to establish and expand sustainable production in Arkansas's eastern region and surrounding areas. The project focused on extending the production season using high tunnels, low tunnels, and black plastic mulch, improving soil fertility using cover crops and plant residue compost, reducing chemical inputs for pest control using solarization and anaerobic soil disinfestation methods, conserving water resources using drip irrigation system combined with plastic mulch and reducing the risk of human pathogens on fresh berries. These objectives were accomplished through extensive outreach and education, including hands-on exercises and demonstrations on sustainable strawberry production across the eastern counties of Arkansas. The project team was comprised of the principal investigator, Leonard Githinji, and five co-principal investigators. The demonstrations at the UAPB farm in Pine Bluff, at the Agricultural Demonstration and Outreach Center in Mariana, and at the UAPB Lone Oak Farm revealed the benefits of growing strawberries in climate-controlled structures. The strawberries grown in high tunnels produced fruits about five weeks earlier, while those grown under the low tunnels produced about four weeks earlier compared to those grown in open field conditions. Many of the strawberry plugs grown in open field conditions did not survive the harsh winter weather, while nearly all the strawberry plants in the high and low tunnels survived. Strawberry growers received extensive training on high and low tunnel production, and they appreciated how those technologies can extend the growing season, enabling early planting of strawberry plugs and increasing the yields and quality of strawberries, leading to increased profitability. Field demonstrations at the UAPB farm in Pine Bluff showed that anaerobic soil disinfestation treatment alone, or ASD combined with soil solarization, significantly reduced weed infestation and soil nematodes. Hands-on demonstrations were conducted on strategies for saving water and for increasing soil fertility using plant compost and cover crops. Participants were also trained on food safety, good agricultural practices, GAPs, and good handling practices, GHPs, for strawberry, and many participants expressed interest in becoming GAP, GHP certified. The measurable outcomes of the project include learning the various sustainable strawberry production techniques including season extension, soil management, pest management, water conservation, and recruiting new growers who utilize their existing high tunnels for strawberry production. We anticipate that the long-term outcome will be increased strawberry production capacity, reduced input and cost of strawberry production, and increased sales, leading to increased economic and environmental sustainability.